elementary particles like quarks and electrons are the foundation upon which all matter in the universe is built. The standard model of particle physics is currently the best theory to describe the most basic building blocks of the universe. It explains how particles called quarks, which make up protons and neutrons, and leptons, which include electrons, make up all known matter. Quarks are elementary particle, they combine to form particles called hadrons, the most stable particles, which are protons and neutrons, the atomic nuclei. All commonly observable matter is made from proton and neutron, which composed of up quarks, down quarks. Quarks are bound together by strong interaction force, gluons. Gluons are thought to interact with quarks and other gluons by color charge. Color charge is a property of quantum chromodynamics, that all three colors mix together to make colorless or white, which has a net color charge of zero. There are six flavors of quarks, up, down, charm, strange, top, and bottom. Top quark is the heaviest quark of all, and quarks also have antiparticle as an antiquarks. Antiquarks differs from the quark only in electric charge, equal magnitude but opposite sign. Mesons particles are a type of hardens, made of an quarks and antiquarks, bound together by strong interactions. An exotic state has more than three quarks, a tetraquark state, an exotic meson, and pentaquark states, exotic baryons, were discovered in 2015. So scientists think there are several more exotic hadron may also exist. Quarks are only known elementary particles that interact with all four fundamental force, electromagnetism, gravitation, strong interaction, and weak interaction. Quarks also interact with Higgs field in some extent, but top quarks, which is massive among all, have the strongest interaction with Higgs field. Leptons are one type of elementary particles, they don't interact with strong force, like Harden's leptons are not made from small units. Electron is a negatively charged subatomic particle, electrons in atoms exist in spherical shell around nucleus, representing energy levels. The next heavier charged leptons are the muon and the tau, like electron, muon and tau are also have, same property but higher mass. Muon and tau particles are highly unstable, because of their heavy mass, so they decay instantly after production. Leptons interact with three fundamental forces, such as, gravitation, the weak interaction, and electromagnetism. Also leptons interact with Higgs field. Like quarks, for every lepton there is an anti-lepton, that differs in a positive sign charge only. For electron, positron is the antiparticle. Similarly for muon and tau, anti-muon and anti-tau is the antiparticle. Neutrino particles are also leptons, very similar to an electron, but has no electrical charge and a very small mass, which might even equal to zero. There are three types of neutrino, the electron neutrino, the muon neutrino, and the tau neutrino, with as well as their antiparticles. Neutrinos only take part in the weak interaction and gravitational field. The weak force has a very short range. The gravitational interaction is extremely weak. Thus, neutrinos pass through normal matter and difficult to detect. Neutrinos are also produced during the process of nuclear fusion in the sun. They pass through the earth at nearly the speed of light. Nearly 100 trillions of neutrinos pass through earth every second. Now we will go to force carriers. Force carriers are particles that give rise to forces between other particles. There is one kind of field for every type of elementary particle. Electromagnetic waves are made up of electric fields, often called E, and magnetic fields, also known as B. E and B are both perpendicular to the direction of propagation vector lambda. Thus, the fields E and B are mutually perpendicular and also they are perpendicular to the direction of propagation vector lambda. The velocity of propagation of electromagnetic waves is equal to the speed of light in free space. The photon is an elementary particle. 
which is associated with the quantum field of electromagnetic wave, also the force carrier for the electromagnetic force interaction. Photons are massless, they only exist as the moving particles, they have no electric charge. Weak interaction, is a fundamental force of nature, the weak force is carried by the W and Z bosons. There are two types of W boson, one with negative electric charge, the W minus boson, in beta minus decay, W minus, boson created, when a neutron is converted to a proton, and immediately W minus boson, decays into an electron and an electron antineutrino. Another one with positive electric charge, the W plus boson. Similarly, in beta plus decay, W plus boson created, when a proton is converted to a neutron, and W plus boson, decays into a positron and an electron neutrino. Z boson is, neutral, Z boson generally produced from the pair production of a particle and its antiparticle, such as, an electron and a positron produce Z boson, and then it decays into, a muon and an anti-muon particle. Generally, weak interaction involves in, some radioactivity, decay of unstable subatomic particles and the nuclear fusion reaction that occurs in the sun. Strong force, a fundamental interaction of nature, binds quarks together, the strong force results from the exchange of force carrier particles called, gluons. Gluons are color charged particles. When quarks are close to each other, they exchange gluons, and create a very strong color force field, that binds the quarks together to form hardens, such as proton. According to the theory of, quantum chromodynamics, gluons and quarks has, color charge property, gluons get together on, different colors of quarks and anti-quarks particles, with exchange of color force, to form, a colorless or white particles. The Higgs boson is the fundamental particle associated with the Higgs field, a field that gives mass to other fundamental particles such as, electrons and, quarks. Higgs boson was discovered in the year 2012, from the collision of, two proton particles, at Large Hadron Collider, CERN. Higgs boson, also known as, God particle, is produced by the quantum excitation of the Higgs field. Graviton particle, is thought to be the carrier of the gravitational field. According to, Einstein's general theory of relativity, gravity as a distortion of space caused by massive object, generates a gravitational field, by warping the geometry of the surrounding space-time. The detection of, gravitational waves provide, some clue that, gravitational force maybe exists in the form of the particle wave duality. There is no complete quantum field theory of gravitons to understand, gravity in better way. If graviton exists, it is expected to be massless like photons, electrically uncharged particles, traveling at the speed of light, 